So there were two pieces that I really wanted from this Supreme season, or tops at least, that I was really going for. There are some cool accessories as well. The first one, though, was the Supreme Bleed logo t-shirt, which you guys know I already got. I did the unboxing, and then I went ahead and picked up another colorway for it. Picked up that uh, yellow and red DHL looking one. But the second piece that I really wanted was this, the bobsled tee. And honestly, people really slept on this. I, I felt like people kind of slept on the Bleed logo, which was really cool in my opinion. Obviously, one of the two pieces I just needed from this season. But people really slept on this bobsled tee. They sat during the drop, and I think there might be still some sizes in stock. I think a big reason people didn't go after this and then the Supreme Bleed logo tee, though, is because they're the cotton jerseys, so they are more expensive. I think the short sleeve cotton jerseys are like 78 or 88, and then the long sleeve cotton jerseys are like 98. So dumb expensive for just a t-shirt but yeah that's you know up to you to decide whether or not you want to spend that kind of money but that being said let's get this open i'm trying to look like i'm from cool run-ins you know we've got john candy up in here shout out classic movie but uh this came in three different colorways i think a black colorway a blue which it was kind of like showcased in and then also a white colorway after careful analyzation of uh, all three colorways, I decided to go with the black colorway. Also, I wonder what stickers we got. I've been hoping to get some more Smurfs ones, but I doubt it. Yeah, two box logos. Anything special in here? I got an order the other day and I had a uh, like seasonal sticker, so that was kind of cool. Yeah, nothing else, just two box logos. Anyway, here's the tea get it open uh it looks like it's like really thin just looking at the back of it i do have another um long sleeve supreme tee it's actually a reglan reglan so like one of those um baseball tees i actually didn't know there was a back print on this either it's got the same print on the back as the front so that's kind of cool but anyway the reason i chose the black one was because the top edge up here on the blue and then also the white colorway was like really sharp I thought it just didn't really like fit in with the rest of the graphic which is of course a bobsled then you have supreme written on it some dudes chilling and then uh, it looked like they used the same exact graphic for the blue and white colorway but for this one obviously still the same graphic but they did make some changes to it whereas the white and blue seemed like it was the same exact graphic on the black one they darkened a lot of the like small details so like their face shields you could see a little bit better but i think this is cool with the darker it adds like more subtlety to it and then you have almost like an acid wash or like bleaching going on on the sides where it's kind of this like overspray looks pretty cool though and actually doesn't feel as thin as this back makes it look where you can like see through the back as far as sizing goes i got an xl for this it's kind of weird about the sleeves being short and uh i want to wear this a lot so dried a bunch hopefully it doesn't shrink hopefully it's all good i think xl should be plenty big i think these cotton jerseys like the bleed logo also are usually oversized or a little bit on the larger side um those t-shirts definitely were so the long sleeve i would imagine is a little bit big as well but yeah i'm gonna try this on let you guys see what it looks like and then give you a little fit review All right, so I feel like XL was definitely the right move. I was expecting it to be a lot bigger. Uh, basically, the only thing about the sizing, I guess, is it's like a little baggy, but as far as sleeves go, I think they're like perfect length. Same with the torso, it's like a little long, but I do like that for the like oversized fit. I'm sure it will shrink a little bit. So I think sizing up to the XL, whereas I usually border large in XL, was definitely the right move. Other than that though, I just love this. It, I mean, it's so cool. It really looks like a vintage tee. Like, the wash on it and maybe that's just their um cotton jerseys which i haven't ever like gotten before this does really remind me of some old like uh skidoo or polaris whatever it is jersey that i have so maybe that's kind of like the style they're going for and i also really like that they have the back print that was one thing that i was kind of disappointed with in the uh, bleed logo tees where they had this huge graphic on the front and then right on the side on the like middle seam it just stopped but yeah as far as that back graphic goes like you guys saw before it's literally just the same thing on the front would have been kind of cool if they did something else but at least there is something going on in the back i think it's still cool i think it would have been fine if they just did like a bunch of this like overspray here where it's like kind of white and washed i think that would have looked fine too but um definitely happy i think this looks dope uh, i really like this the blank you know as far as it goes you know the sleeves maybe aren't as proportioned to the rest of the increased sizing as everything else you know 
the torso feels a little longer like I said but the sleeves don't feel like that much longer even though I sized up with the XL so if that is kind of your concern I would you know size up with this but man I love it this is a dope piece <laughs> Anyway, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Feel free to leave a like, comment, subscribe, do all of that or none of it. Just stopping by and watching means enough. And I'll catch you in the next video.